Hi guys, it's me Paula and welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone's having a good day. I'm absolutely shattered. Um, homeschooling today was a complete bust. I was just, oh, we got everything done, but it was just a, oh. For those of you at home with kids, please tell me I'm not the only one in this situation. I've got three children of very different ages. I've got one that started high school, secondary school. He's first year. I've got one that's kind of, is fifth primary five, so that's kind of like middle, upper, and um, primary. And I've one that's just started primary one. And they all have different needs. They all have different, you know, requirements that they need, things that they're doing. And my little girl's like a complete spitfire. She's like runs around. She, she's really difficult with her sleeping. Whereas my two boys were are very good at sleeping earlier on. Hold on, just one second. The cat's wanting to come in. Sorry, my cat's got a new habit. We've got two cats, Ash and Oreo. And Ash has got this completely annoying habit now of scratching at windows and doors to come in. And she decides to like pile up on top of our roof, walk along. This is, I'm upstairs, you see, just now filming. And she just like paws at the window. It makes a little scratching noise to come in. She just uses this place like a hotel. Yeah, anyway, back to homeschooling. So today, you know, my little girl, she she's not very great at sleeping. Like, my boys were always great at sleeping, 7 to 7 from very early on. Stop doing that with the carpet, Asha. Come here. See if it could come up and make an appearance. And she was really difficult going down last night. We took her out for two walks yesterday. We did the geocaching. And then my husband went to correct for another walk. She, we did games. We did lots, so many things to try and make her tired. And she's still, I don't know. I know sometimes she will go down to sleep after doing lots of like exercise. But last night she went hyper. I don't know what was going on. So she was tired today and really, really difficult to do any work with today. So I am shattered. I'm shattered. But anyway, I'm doing my thing now. I'm doing a bit of unboxing. So today I am going to be um, unboxing pyjama drama. Now, I absolutely adore Pajama Drama. Pajama Drama is a sister company, and I always mention this in the Lemonade Box and Boxings. It's a sister company to the Lemonade Box, but this is bi-monthly, so it's every two months. So every two months, you'll get uh, charged £25 off your account and get a lovely, lovely box that's filled with pyjamas and self-care items. Now, the pyjamas are pretty good. They're pretty size inclusive. I think they run from around about size 8, round about size 22, I think check on the website and they're so you get a pair of those pajamas and they're always very cute and you also and also seasonal so you know you might get like shorts and a, a pajama top in the summer or you might get fleecy pajamas in the winter and you get some self-care items so it's a big box Ooh, the big box and it's like big fleecy pajamas just what i was mentioning okay i'm dropping things on the ground here it's very packed so oh, what's this free bath bomb scan to claim from the mag lab sleep deeper oh i might have to do that okay so it says here and i am just really just dropping everything today um it's not <laughs> it's <laughs> i just go to my bed okay so it says here hey babe look at you you cozy queen you're totally gorgeous you haven't even got them on yet and we're thinking who knew pajamas could look so good i'm looking at his pajamas and i'm like I, I need to get my pajamas a whole bunch of love and care has gone into your pyjama drama box, so sincerely we hope each item encourages you to take some time out, enjoys cosy nights and like never before. And then there's a competition, you can take yourself a pyjama, a picture of yourself in the pyjamas and send them into like, I think they're like Instagram. <laughs> I don't think they want a picture of me in my pyjamas. Um, and then we've got the list of all the things that are included in this box. Okay, so the first thing we've got eggs good old figs and rouge figs and rouge seems to make an appearance every now and again in every box and this is the figs and rouge Ooh. renew and refine pour detox revival serum okay that's interesting i've never ever seen this before and i do quite like figs and rouge i know some people are a bit iffy about it some people love them some people don't like them but i quite like figs and rouge and it says a micro refined pour renewal detox serum it's worth 35 pounds 
Okay, when we say this is a godsend, you have no idea how serious we are. It is a complexion refining and resurfacing serum designed to promote cellular renewal, excellent and healthy skin revival. Its lightweight enhanced formulation targets minor imperfections to help deliver a luminous skin tone, whilst also minimising pores to promote a youthful glowing complexion. Its multi-action formulation also encourages collagen synthesis and improves texture. Excellent. Sounds amazing. Um, fantastic. So you, pre you put it to Apply it to freshly cleansed skin, work the serum in evenly, um, especially across the T-zone and over the cheek areas. Apply serum in the morning before makeup for a perfect foundation base or at night for a complete detoxifying effect. That sounds great. Now we've got two, ooh, two um, lip masks there by the brand Soon. Now I've never heard of this brand before. Tell me if you've tried these before. And um, we've got a watermelon one, a hydrating watermelon lip mask and a strawberry lip mask with collagen so those are the two the two masks and it says here um soon a strawberry lip mask with collagen um which is worth six pounds and it says fancy treating your lips at a time of their life during lockdown this will do exactly that you can kiss lackluster lips goodbye pat with high impact ingredients and deliver a healthy looking pout this was designed to plump hydrate and lighten dark spots and fight collagen breakdown and uv damage it makes lips firmer and stores them with collagen. I thought you were going to get a sort of like that kind of effect. Um, whilst improving smoothness and combating signs of aging. And then we've got the hydrating one, which um, this hydrating skin softening watermelon infused lip mask is ideal for stress, sun parched skin. A must have lip treatment to diminish fine lines, hydrate the entire mouth area, and gently exfoliate the skin of the lips. Very good. So there's two lip masks there. And then we've got a uh, deep sleep. From the mag lab it looks like one of those um sprays and this is a magnesium body spray that's kind of cool because i was kind of thinking oh god it's not another pillow spray i've got tons of them but this is actually a body spray and it says let's be real here everyone could use some better sleep are we right this is worth 750 we all need to unwind and let go of the stresses of the day as we relax into calm and deep sleep that's why You've got this little this little bad boy. It's designed to help relax the muscles and nerves, to soothe the rest legs and quiet the mind. So we spray and massage it into the skin 30 minutes before bedtime. And in case you need something else to adore about this product, it's lavender scented. I love, 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 love lavender scented products. Oh, it's gorgeous. I know some people are a bit iffy, but it's a bit like rose, isn't it? Some people really hate the smell of rose. I love the smell of rose. And I love the smell of lavender. And that must be where that mag bag... Mag Lab, not Mag Bag, the um, leaflet comes from. Okay, so final product here, and it's it's the pajamas, yahoo! And it says the pajamas, the drop box, Teddy, hug kisses, hug kisses, pajamas, worth twenty seven ninety nine. Ah, the pajamas you've all been waiting for. This design is so popular since we announced it, and we are happy to finally get them out to you. They're super soft and golden brown. I can see why they say Teddy because you look like a little bear wearing them, I think. They're super soft and golden brown. They have cuffed sleeves and trousers to help you keep you super stylish and their blanket material makes them absolutely perfect for winter. They can be worn as loungewear or pyjamas, have a drawstring waist for maximum comfort plus pockets to keep your essentials close or to keep your hands warm. Um, and it, you know, wash in 30 degrees and tumble dry and low. Do not iron decorate. So I'm excited. Okay, these maybe would be the... These are these are cute, right? Okay, so they're not the most sexy of pajamas, so they're not like sort of sexy time pajamas, definitely not. But they are they're really cute. I I you know they 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 they, are, they they do have an interesting color to them. It is very much teddy bear esque. You look like a teddy bear esque, but I love the XOXO. They've got like cuffed sleeves. They're very 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 fleecy. They're they're like a teddy bear material. They are cute. Um, I think when I wear them, my husband's going like, oh my god what are you wearing but you're like super comfy i think and let's see the bottoms um so the bottom <laughs> so the bottoms oh yeah they're so <laughs> I, I can't decide i do like them because i'll be super comfy but i can't decide if if i like the design or not if it's if it is too much teddy bear-esque but i do like them i don't know you know tell me what you think down below i think they're kind of cute and there certainly would be like a slopping around the house they're not going to look the most attractive on oh, and i don't think they're not going to be like unless you're like i don't know there's some people that can seem to work any look kind of, those those people that can work anything and they're really annoying <laughs> but I, I i might just look like a big plump 
a cuddly teddy bear. <laughs> My husband's just going to look at it and he's just going to be like, what what are you wearing what are you wearing those are horrendous but they look so cozy oh they'll be so comfy anyway thanks very much for watching the video tell me down below what you think of the box and i will see you guys in the next video Bye bye